It's fine. I'm just gonna casually walk around. I mean, it's neat that you can walk around during this. Probably not the safest thing. Like, I don't know, opening doors in the middle of this. Like, I should not be allowed to do this. Uh, oh my goodness, what just happened? Oh, oh, I just fell out of the train. I just fell out of the... Um... So we're doing something today a little bit different. I'd imagine this is something that Komodo shouldn't be doing, especially in real life. But we're going to be playing with trains. We've got the EMD F125, and we're here in the new train sim world. And uh, yes, this is a passenger train. Like, you can only imagine the people throwing up here in the back. By the way, this is super detailed. Yeah, it's been a long time since we played uh, one of these train sim world games. I think it was number two, or it could have been the original one that I played on the channel. Uh, you guys seem to really enjoy it, so I wanted to try out the new one here. Been a while since we've uh, played with trains, and I'm sure nothing bad's gonna happen. Nothing bad ever happens, right? All right, so we're in our little cozy engineer seat. I think we need to start up the generator field. Uh, so we'll turn that on. I'm actually skipping ahead. I know a little bit about what I'm doing here. Uh, we need to put the reverser handle in. Uh, we'll turn these over to dim. There we go. Uh, we're almost ready to move here, so we need to set the uh, brakes in the correct mode. So we need to turn brake mode to... is it passenger? Because we're hauling passengers. Is, like, freight a stronger brake mode, or how does this work? I'm actually kind of curious. Alright, so we need to let the non-existent passengers in. They don't trust me with real passengers yet in the game, but trust me, we're gonna get to it. Alright, so those are open there. We're loading the fake passengers in right now and then we should get to close the doors and we can get moving here. Uh, so you hear the beeping? I guess that's a warning. Don't stand in the door, you dingus. And we are ready to go. So those are closed up there. So we're gonna put the reverser into the forward position and I think we're gonna slowly get into the gas here. Or throttle, whatever you wanna call it. So we want to increase the master controller. So if we're going to go, let's go P1 here. Is that, does that do anything for us? I don't feel like it is. Maybe we need to go a little bit faster. Oh, let's give it a little bit more uh, speed. Let's go P2. Oh, yep. You can hear it doing its thing. Hold on. Let's listen to it from the outside. Oh man. Playing with something way too powerful for me. Okay. Let's check our brakes. I think we need to release these. So we go all the way back. I think almost all the way forward's emergency, which there's a chance we'll need that uh, before the end of the episode. Oh, 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 it's squeaking a little bit on Sander. There we go. And yeah, buddy, listen to that thing. Uh, yeah, we're departing. Hey, I got it moving. I did that. Okay, Bell, you're nice and annoying. All right, so we went up to P7. Uh, let's go for a P8. There we go. We're going, uh, we're getting points. Uh, well, that was the speed limit. Oh, I need to set it to idle. But, I mean, I'm having fun picking up speed, and we get to our destination much faster. This is probably something a trainee should never do. Let's contact the dispatcher real quick. Yeah, I'd like a, uh, number five with extra cheese and no salt on the fries, please. This is, uh, I'm a very responsible adult. All right, you know, let's set it to idle that way. Just kind of maintain speed here. We'll let it do its thing. Uh, we're coming up to a tunnel. Can I hang my head out? Okay, the window is open. Am I allowed to get up? I don't think that's a thing. Like, I don't think you should get up from here. Blinding light. Oh, geez, that was bright. Okay. Let's get a look at our train in motion. They got a sweet new uh, photo mode in this game, which is kind of cool. And, man, look at the uh, scenery. Very beautiful area right now. Uh, we're in California. At least I think we are. Uh, it's, it's the scenarios I picked out, but the training, I mean, what part of California is this? Okay, so we got to stop at locations. 1.4 kilometers that way. Well, why does it tell me? Oh, we're coming around. We got a bend up here. Okay, this might be a bad time to ask. What is the best way to stop this? Does it just slap on the emergencies? Or, I mean, I think there's a little bit of a... Is this a break here? Uh, uh-oh. No, I don't think that's a break. Okay, so the station is coming up around the corner. We're starting to, uh, maybe I should start to actually try to break. Uh, minimal ac application. What, what does that mean? Uh, no, okay, we, let's start breaking. Uh, are we doing the thing? Okay, the power, does this need to just go forward? Oh my goodness, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, the station's coming up quick. All right, jab it on to emergency. Uh, oh, hold on. Release it from emergency? Is it still? Uh oh, I think once you press that, like, we're, yeah, we're slowing down a lot here. Okay, well, I think 
I definitely overreacted there by slamming on the emergencies. I'm pretty sure I could have just went gradually down. And here we come into the station here. I think I see my braking zone. All right. Uh, I want to stop at the platform, please. Start to slow it down. And let's go uh, full service here. Come on, baby. Slow. Slow. Oh, that squeak. Release for a second. Uh, it's making a very bad sound, but you know what? We are coming up to a stop pretty much in our spot we were supposed to be in. I mean, a little off, but I feel like I can just nudge it here and we'll be fine. There we go. And beautiful. I think we, uh, we did it. Great work. That concludes the basics of uh, running this train. See, I get a star for that. Okay, so we are in Los Angeles Union Station, and we're going to Vista Canyon. Uh, I don't really know, like, are we? how many stops do we have? Is this it? I'm already in the train. What the heck? Oh, and I, I got to get out and look at this. Like, wait, is it, wait, is the platform on this side? I think it is. <laughs> wait, I earned a reward for using a door. <laughs> They're setting the bar low for Komodo, aren't they? Oh, uh, you know what? I take it back. I don't see any passengers. Uh, where is everybody? I'm supposed to drive this train to a place. Uh, you know what? Let's just close this. I guess I'm supposed to open the doors. Uh, all right. Unlock doors. So those are now unlocked. Uh, I hear police sirens in the background. You know you're in LA. All right. We're supposed to be loading up past. There's people walking from the rear, which I think those could be the people. Uh, hold on. Let's go look. I'm just going to greet these people. You let them know that they're going to be completely safe today. Hello, everybody. Anybody else getting aboard? Can I just leave? Can I go with you guys? What do you think the guy's thinking like, uh, is the person driving the train supposed to be out of his uh, seat? Oh, I think we have a schedule, by the way. I should probably get back in and get moving here. All right, we need to lock the doors. Uh, all right, so engineer seat. Let's go ahead and hit Y to lock doors. Okay, those are gonna be closing up. I don't even know if I saw anybody get aboard. There are people still back there though. All right, and we are good to move here. So Glendale track one, supposed to be there by 6.51. I believe we are running a little behind on schedule. So let's go ahead and move the brake to passenger. Let's insert the reverser handle, put that in the forward position. Uh, lights are gonna go up to dim. Uh, gonna go ahead and hit that bell. Give it a little toot toot of the horn because I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I think everything is set up and ready to go. We're gonna go ahead and release our handle here. And we are gonna give it uh, a little bit of... Uh, also, the pop-ups are so, like, distracting. Like, just tell me I'm doing a good job and maybe put it off in the bottom left. Okay, we are moving. So we got five miles uh, to our Glendale track one. That's gonna be our first stop. Um... Not sure I'm quite comfortable with stopping this train. Let's give it a little toot here. Uh, watch all the people sitting at the station. I mean, it's cool looking. Like, we're operating this thing. We're, we're doing the thing right now. Uh, am I supposed to have my bell on right now? I, I think that's probably a thing. Yeah, it's kind of immersive seeing all the people standing on the side of the tracks. All right, we're going to deactivate that. All right, start picking up some speed. How fast do you think we can get there? Uh, is that the speed limit up in the top right? Do I get pulled over if I... You know, don't do the thing. I don't know. All right, you know, let's uh, let's light this thing up here. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> We're doing the thing. Look at the highway over there. Yo, do they have any bullet trains in this game? Like that'd be great. Also, uh, we are we're kind of hauling the mail around these corners. Um, are we good? I hope we're good. Uh, oh jeez. Oh, that's a kink up there. We're okay. We're speeding right now. Um, no, we can make it, right? Oh. <laughs> Everybody's probably holding on for dear life. It's fine, everybody. We got this. Oh, my goodness. We are uh, we're booking along. We are definitely speeding, but I feel like we're behind a little bit, so we kind of have to, right? Oh, wait, is that... Where's L.A. at? Like, oh, there it is back there. I can see the, uh, the skyline. About as close as I want to get to L.A. All right. Uh, we're booking it right now. We're going 71. I like how it did change it to miles per hour. So were we actually in for the intro? Like maybe that wasn't California. It, it looked a little odd. Like it didn't look like California, at least from the pictures. I mean, it could have been in another section. Uh, oh, we're driving significantly over speed limit. Okay, I will back it off a little bit. I mean, we should be on idle anyway. Um, should I get a little bit of break in? Okay, let's, let's just get a little, little, little break. Just a little break. Yeah, I'm not getting any train points up in the top right. 
but I feel like we made up some time there, definitely. Uh, we're 3.5 miles out. I don't know how long this actual route is in the game. How do you think the passengers are faring back there? How you guys look back here? They don't, they're not pressed against the window, so I think we're doing something right. I think we're within speed, so I'm going to release that brake. That way, we just kind of maintain this 50 or 49 miles per hour. You get points for driving under the speed limit, but I'm pretty sure the people in the back don't care because they want to get to their destination. I mean, I guess you could say they want to get to their destination alive. Jeez, it felt like we just left LA like really freaking quick there. Uh, there is no sign of the big city anymore. Okay, so our speed limit's definitely 50, so I'm gonna try to increase it a little bit. Get a little more out of it. I think hovering right around 50, maybe 55. That Maybe they give you five over like the police officers sometimes do. So would you guys trust me uh, driving a train? Huh? Operating it? Is that is that the terminology? Would you guys trust me? I mean, I don't think I'm doing that bad of a job right now. I mean, we might have gone a little fast there in the beginning, but I mean, we're supposed to be there by 6.51, so I need to get these passengers here on time. Is there a map here? Like, why is the map not available? Like, what am I supposed to be going off of? Besides the whole fact the game's got gigantic markers in my way telling me what I'm supposed to do. By the way, can I go 80 through here? Hold on, P8 right here? I mean, we technically have a stop coming up, so I don't think I want to go quite up to 80 and then try to break for this. Okay, station is coming up. Let's go to idle here, and let's go ahead and start to apply some break here. Okay, what does the station look like? It's kind of open looking. Okay, brakes, brakes, brakes. I don't have markers on this one, it looks like, so I'm just gotta, well, actually, no, I think I do see a marker up there. Okay, we're starting to roll. I feel like I'm rolling better now. Uh, we're going about 20. Let's go ahead and start to do minimal application. Uh, start to slow this bad boy down. And here we go. Give it a couple of horns. Uh, all right. I like the bell. It's, it's nice. Okay, full service here. Uh, oh, it's going to be close. I, I think I'm going to hit it here. Oh, how close am I going to be? How close was that? Okay. That was nice. We have made it to our stop. All right, objective complete. We're gonna go ahead and unlock the doors uh, real quick. Are they loading on both sides? Let's see the left side doors. Uh, what about, is there an unlock all, is there a switch inside? I think we need to open our right sides. I think that one's you. Okay, so there we go, right side. And oh look, there's another train coming in. Nice. All right, so both doors should be unlocked. We're loading passengers right now. Uh, well, it says we are. Is anybody actually getting in or getting off? Uh, there's somebody in the back, I think, approaching. Okay, we are, we were actually ahead of schedule there. So, me speeding, because I gotta wait till 6.52 before I can even depart. So, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm actually, let's just turn off that bell right now. Yeah, can I go get a coffee or something? I mean, Komodo's doing a good job. Like, I'm a well ahead of schedule. Some people might have puked. It's okay, I'm just gonna walk amongst the people here. I mean, it's kind of neat that you get off the train. Even though I don't think I would be actually getting off the train. What if I had to poop or something? Do they have a bathroom in here? Hey, everybody. Can we walk in and look at the... Oh, we can. We can look, come in and look at the passengers. I like that I can just come back here and casually sit in the seat. Can I make a poop? Um, yep. Nope. That's... Okay, this doesn't... None of this opens, does it? Okay. All right. Well, I better sit in my seat and wait to close the doors. We want to stick on schedule here today. I don't know how many stops we've got. Okay, ETA 20 seconds before we are supposed to take off. I don't think I need to keep these doors open. Uh, they've been open, so we are going to go ahead and close those. Okay, those are closed. We are ready to prepare for launch here, or at least those brakes. And we are going to go ahead and start to move here. There we go. Objective complete. Next stop is 4.8 miles. We're going to Burbank, uh, downtown track two. It's going to be our next stop and location. Uh, looks like we can go 80 on here. So we're going to hit this thing up to P8, activate the uh, bell and horn. There we go. Have I actually seen any crossings? Have we? I don't think we've gone over anything. There we go. All uh, right. It's going to take a sec for this thing to wind up. So we're going to Burbank, California. What's in Burbank? Anybody know? Okay. We are on a slight incline right now. So it's taking a little bit more to get up to full speed here. Uh, but yeah, once we climb close to the 80, which I wonder how fast we can actually go. I mean... You think I could hit it maybe a little over 100? Probably is not advised at all. Look at all the traffic. It is neat. It feels like they made the outside world feel alive with, like, traffic and pedestrians. You gotta appreciate that. All right, we're on a little bit of a decline. Let's go into idle here. So we locked it right around uh, 80 here to uh, 3.2 miles 
Uh, we're supposed to arrive uh, and stop uh, at 6.58. By the way, is it really 6.55 a.m.? Oh, we're in the morning commute right now. Either that or that's not accurate. I think that's accurate. All right, we've got another... It's going to be two minutes before we're supposed to come to stop. About 1.2 uh, miles out. Okay, coming up. Uh, let's go ahead and start to minimal application. Slow it down a little bit. And let's start to increase that. Uh, there we go. Okay. Oh, need to kill a little more speed. Oh, we're coming into the station a little hot on this one. Urgh, emergency brakes. Okay. Sorry, everybody in the back. Uh, no, this is fine. Okay. Well, you know, jabbing the emergency brakes did help us there. Okay, let's release them. There we go. <laughs> Sorry for the abrupt uh, stop there. All right, let's go unlock the passengers. Uh, you know, I actually don't think I needed them. Uh, it's kind of hard for me to judge, like, how... Uh, much or how little I need to break Okay, people are getting out and people are getting on we got about a minute 20 seconds till we need to depart So we're still uh, on schedule here uh, Has the time actually gone up currently 657 in the morning? Okay uh, We have set here as long as we need to I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna close Both the doors both actually I was only supposed to open I think the right side doors <laughs> left side they end up on the uh, got them in the middle here no man's land. Okay, we must wait 50 more seconds and we'll see where our next destination takes us. You know, I like the passenger trains. I would like to do some freight maybe here in the future if that's something you guys want to see. Uh, maybe try some of the different trains, some of the newer stuff for Train Sim World 4. I know these are games where you can like buy the old routes that were in like the other games if I'm not mistaken, but I want to try to keep it with the new stuff here. Okay, brakes are released and we should start to... It takes a little bit to get this thing uh, moving. Give another couple honks here. I don't know if I'm doing the right procedure, to be honest with you. I mean, I'm beeping enough to let people know there's a freaking train moving. Like, don't stand in front of it. I mean, it's not like you don't know where it's going to go. It's the tracks. Unless we get it to derail. I mean, I could try to speed there. You know what? Let's, uh, let's push this train. Let's go P8 here. Uh, it says 80 uh, miles per hour. So see, brakes are off. A uh, little honk. Go ahead and turn that bell off. There we go. Uh, we are moving. I should probably be honking for crossings. Is that a crossing up there? No, I think we're just coming through this area. I don't think there's actually a crossing. It looks like there's a couple little uh, different routes and multiple tracks. All right, we're push. We're supposed to be going 50 through here. On, let's do that. Idle for a second. When's it turn to uh, back to 80 here? Oh wait, there's actually people like working and stuff over here. Oh yeah, I guess we're not supposed to speed by them. Uh, also, we're by a highway here, which is pretty cool looking. Not gonna lie, I don't know how many more stops I have. Uh, we got six minutes, well, about five minutes to get to our next stop. Definitely think we're running ahead of schedule here. Uh, people could probably appreciate that because we still ultimately wait uh, for the time that we're supposed to wait. That way people can get on as scheduled. Okay, we're coming up to the airport stop. I, I don't see an airport though. Where's the, that kind of looks like a terminal building. That Kind of doesn't though. Wait, where is the airport? Is it left side maybe? I mean, it kind of sounds like there's a plane taking off. I'm not sure if that's a plane or if that's my train. Uh, don't see anything. Oh, I think I actually see terminals on the left side. Okay, there's definitely an airport over here. All right, let's go ahead and we're gonna start to break here. Let's see if we can nail it this time. I feel like we've been kind of screwy on the brakes uh, last couple times. All right, starting to slow down. Uh, there is a train on the, uh-oh. I apparently failed to signal that I was, you didn't at least let me see the two trains hit head on. <laughs> I, I noticed it looked strange. I was like, hey, there's another train on the tracks. I didn't know I was supposed to wait my turn. <laughs> I guess I wasn't paying attention. This is why you don't allow me to do this. So we at least got to keep the uh, the points that we had. Okay, so uh, they've given me a second chance for some reason. Uh, we're in a little bit different setup here train-wise. Uh, this is, I'm like really high up in the sky right now on this end. Uh, let, hold on, let's look at the other end. So the other end was kind of what we were in last time. But yeah, I'm on this side. Wait, can I? What? What? What is this? Hold on. Oh, there's people aboard. Hi, everybody. Am I going backwards? You guys just aimed the wrong way. I think I'm supposed to go this way. So I wanted to test out one of these and like push it to the limit. Like we, we've figured out kind of what we're doing here uh, loosely. 
Cap light on. Uh, I like that when you click every button, they're just like, yeah, you get points for that. And you know what? I can appreciate that. Okay, cab setup on. So I can do that. Generator filled on. Engine's already in the run position. I think sounds like it's started up. Put our reverser handle in. Okay, what kind of brakes? So they brake cut out. I think that needs to be cut in. And then we'll release this. And I think we're good. Let's put the bell on. Uh, automatic train. Oh, ATS acknowledged. I, I don't honestly know exactly what I did wrong last time. I mean, obviously there was a train coming. I think I was supposed to stop and let them pass. Okay, reverser goes actually forward. And here we go. Are we going the right? Hold on. Which way am I supposed to be going? Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, we're actually, yeah, you can't go any further back. We've done the thing. Uh, so we're in a little bit different city. Oh, oh, are those people coming to the station? Sorry, guys. <laughs> You're a little too late. Actually, I never opened the doors. Oh, it's fine. Yeah, I just want to see, like, if we were to just push this, like, how fast will one of these trains go? Is this a bad? This is probably a bad. I can feel the death stares of all the uh, train enthusiasts right now going, what are you doing? It's fine. I know what I'm doing. I'm a professional. So I'm getting up during uh, the middle of this. Do I have a bathroom? Like, how am I supposed to potty? Uh, wait, what's this handle? Oh, emergency brake valve. Probably don't want to hit that. It's fine. I'm just going to casually walk around. I mean, it's neat that you can walk around during this. Probably not the safest thing. Like, I don't know, opening doors in the middle of this. Like, I should not be allowed to do this. Uh, oh, my goodness. What just happened? Oh, oh, I just fell out of the train. I just fell out of the... Um, yep. Well, I mean, it's fine. You just go over. There's got to be like an in and out. We're in California. Okay, this time we are going to allow... Oh, uh, it's left doors. Any right doors unlocked. There we go. Right doors unlocked. You guys better hurry up. We are departing in less than one minute. And we are going to be hauling the mail. It's going to get crazy up in here. All right, we're picking up speed. I promise I'm not going to jump out on this one. Uh, so the passengers are safe. All right, uh, let's go ahead and look at this. Uh, we're moving pretty good. 6.7 uh, miles until our next station, but we're not going there. We're just, we're speeding here. We're at maximum throttle. We're going to blow through that station. Okay, we're on a little bit of an incline. We're still going pretty fast. We're up to 80. I'm hoping we get a downhill section. I, want, I really want to see what the top speed is. Open that window up. Oh, it's not a big opening. I was going to let some fresh air in. It's fine. Okay, we're at 83 miles per hour. Uh, our amps are going down. Probably because I'm like full power. They're supposed to stick it in an idle and let it kind of regenerate, but we don't have time for that. Well, 85. We're now in the red. Driving significantly over the speed. You're not going to get any of those uh, train points for that. By the way, can I click these buttons? I haven't clicked these yet. Oh, wait. Is this for the doors? I can actually click. Oh, I don't have to hit the hotkeys, I don't think. Oh, by the way, here's the breaker, I believe. Uh, they don't need heater controls. There we go. It's a nice straight track. Not many bends. Um, I was hoping that maybe we'd have like a downhill and like wavy section, but we're up to 98 miles per hour. Uh, we're almost up to 100 here. Do you guys think I could jump out and actually hit the station? I bet you I can. Okay, 100 miles per hour. All right, we are booking it pretty fast. I'm going to go ahead and open this door up here. Uh, let's go set in the doorway. Hey, that's open. Station is coming up at 1.4 uh, miles. I mean, you get a nice uh, view of the outside area here. Well, we're really about to have a runaway train. All right, we are closing in so fast on the station. Uh, I wonder if I can actually hit it right. Wait, hold, hold. All right, jump down. Whee! What the? So how confused do you think everybody is at the station? By the way, this is a beautiful station. I'm going to go walk around. Uh, can we go to the hot dog cart? I do find it kind of weird that they let you just kind of walk into town. Oh, invisible wall. I was about to say, we're going to turn this into a bus simulator. That'd be the ultimate simulator. You can have trains, buses, and then maybe we go to the airport and fly a plane. But if you guys want to see more of this, let me know down in the comment section below. We'll see you guys next time.